now from Ozarks First. You're watching Color 10 News at 6. Right now, the Missouri Highway Patrol is searching for a kayaker who went missing on Bull Creek in Walnut Shade yesterday afternoon. This happened while they were out on the water with two other friends. One of the men survived, but the body of another was found today. Meanwhile, family and friends of the kayakers are talking now about the tragedy. Color 10's Crystal Blair is live with the update from Branson tonight. Crystal. Well, David and Heather, as you would imagine, the family right now in shock and disbelief. They tell me that these three kayakers, all from the Branson area, were very good friends, and they were hoping on the day that this tragedy happened to just have a good time kayaking on Bull Creek. The three men were all together on Bull Creek kayaking yesterday afternoon when the current from the creek, which had flooded from Tuesday storms, overcame them. It's just, it's terrible for their families, terrible. So just a lot of prayers went up last night for all of them. Justin Seal is on the left and Alex Eckern is on the far right. His body was found today. My husband actually has kayaked the, this creek numerous times. Um, and, you know, it's something that they all love to do. Family members say the kayaks eventually crashed into each other as the men attempted to get out. And that's when they all capsized. Seal held onto a log for dear life. Monica Seal is his wife. What my husband said was that, you know, they were having fun. They were all talking about how much they were having fun with it. And, and um, you know, and it just happened in a split second. I'm still just kind of in disbelief about it. I'm, I'm very grateful. I'm, I'm thankful that he made it, but I, I still kind of, part of me feels guilty in a way. I don't, I don't know, I'm, I feel bad for the other, you know, two and, and the families. Somehow, Seal managed to walk two and a half miles to the home of Tracy Boyce. He was white, scared, I'm sure in shock. Boyce and her husband were cleaning up flood water in their home at the time. He just explained to us that he had put in a kayak, he and two buddies up above us, and they had crashed into each other and um, tipped over, and he hadn't seen his buddies since then. And while flooding in Bull Creek is common, Boyce says, this was one of the worst she's ever seen. We normally have what we call a good flood every year since we've been here. Um, this is the second to the worst we've seen. Now, Justin Seal, the one that survived, he was 36 or is 36 years old, I should say. And Alex Eckern, the one whose body was found today, was just 23. Now, we did blur the picture of the kayaker that's still missing out of courtesy to his family. And we're not going to release his name as of yet. Reporting live in Branson, Crystal Blair, Ozarks First. All right, Crystal, thanks for the update there.